Hello my friends, this is Verse 26. Welcome to another video. And today, um, this video is going to be about for the album Noobs of Minecraft, aka New People to a Game. If, if you know, if you want to know what that means. So, um, basically this, this video is for noobs. But, um, if you don't have anything else to watch today, um, you can watch this. But this is mainly for noobs, so I don't recommend you watching this if you're a pro at this game. So, basically, um, th I'm making this video for all the noobs. Okay? So basically, what you do when you, when you load up Minecraft, you you if you want to do battle mode, you can do that first. But I don't recommend you doing that first. So you so you do new new game. So you press play game. Switch your storage device if you've been using that, or if you're just using your um I forgot what it's called your um storage storage system or whatever it's called um and then you, and then you craft <coughs> craft and then you hit new new world or tutorial world if you want to do that one too. So guys, um, not a chair chatter. Let me just explain the menu first over here. So this is your menu. You have the world name. I'm name this new craft. You can change your game mode survival and creative mode. <coughs> now when you create a new world, you cannot use adventure mode because in adventure mode you can't place stuff. Um, which is basically like survival but with easy awesome playing. So you can do um three difficulties. I mean four difficulties. I think I think another one's coming up soon. Not hundred percent sure. You can take the packs. I only have. You basically start off this one to recommend. I'm going to play offline. That's why I feel like it. And then we can create new worlds. Now normally, um, this is this is a random seed, and normally on the Xbox 360 edition, before um TU, I think it was TU. Twenty nine or twenty eight. Or even twenty five, the world used to took used to take so long, but um, when creating a new one, it took even longer. So this is your spawn point. You start up here, you get a map immediately. So um, from this point, you, you basically wait. I forgot to put myself in the default skin. I'm just gonna do a default skin for this. So I'm gonna do a default skin for this. So um, sometimes there's good spawns, sometimes there's bad spawns. So basically, what you want to do. Cause you want to go to the nearest tree and get some wood. Now you mine with the RT button. You place with LT, which I'll get to later. Now there are certain achievements on Minecraft. There are the basic ones and the hard ones. The basic ones are the first one you should get. Like I thought, um, the game wood one was actually the first one, but it's actually taking inventory. That's the second. That's actually the first one. It should be the first one because everybody looks at their maps. Now you don't have to get the whole tree. If you want trees floating around, you can have that. But I'm doing this on my um, USB. Ooh, work a village. Um, so here's some more stuff. You can uh, you can also use you you can also find villages near your spawn. You can find villages also. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to look in the villagers' chest. Well, I'm not going to take anything. If it's any, if it's like wood or something, I'll take. So in, in you can find good stuff, bad stuff. Apparently, there's a diamond here. Which I'm not going to take. I'm going to take the food because I am playing on easy. And sprint jumping will deteriorate your hunger bar faster. Hunger and health are two important things. So, um, I'm going to drop that. So now, um, what you want to do is go to where you punch your tree. There's already spider down there. I'm just going to get away from it. I'm going to shoot over here. So, what you want to do is you open your crafting in interface. Which is your X by default. Then, depending what wood you have, you're going down to the wood that you have. In my in my way, it mine is first box. So you press A to craft, and then you can go to your sticks, craft some eight of those. Then the crafting table. So what you want to do is to place it in your crafting table using LT, and then you want to make a pickaxe. If you're wondering um, these other tools, the other wooden tools, I just like to I just like to use a pickaxe right now to, to like do most of this stuff. So I'm just going to kill the sheep with a pickaxe, so it doesn't run away. You should kill them with swords, but I'm just going to say I'm just going to use it for now. So I'm going to grab some stone quickly, and I'm going to start talking about shelter while I grab the stone. I and mean, shelter is a very important thing in Minecraft. Um, you. And you need a shelter before all the mobs come out. Now, if you're playing on peaceful, you're totally fine. But any other game mode, um, besides peaceful, 
Um, if you don't get a shelter before it's night, then you're basically done. Or, but you can still live in here if you're not. So, um, so what you want to do now is you can clear out your, your hot bar line. That's what I normally do. Head to the crafting table, and then make your stone tools. Now, to do this, <coughs> you're going to go from structures to tools and weapons. I, LB and I read the bumpers. And then go, then, then go to the stone sword. Go down, wait it, stone. A few more sticks. There we go. And I like to put one in order, so I'll take this. So um, apparently we need, we need to find some more sheeps. Oh, pumpkins. No, no sheep, no sheep. So um, what you want to do is to get um, three pieces of wool to make a bed. And you also want to hunt pigs and other things that drop food. Pigs, sheep, and cows drop food. Cows also drop weather, which I'm going to talk about soon. Now, sprint jumping is what I normally do, so that's not really a good idea. I'm going to eat some raw stuff right now. So, I'm, I'm just going to talk. And, and also, when, when you're getting all this stuff, make sure you start thinking about your shelter. Um. Your shelter can be either a little hut for your first night, we you can make it out of dirt or whatever for your first night. It's not to be pretty for your first night. And, um, it doesn't have to be pretty for your first night, but, um, you can do it the second night or the, like the, the second day. But what you want to do now is you want to, so your first shelter should be recommended as a little cable. I know there's not a starter for this, but I'm just gonna take one out anyway. Now, um, let me, let me just go. So, if you want to exit the game, um, you can press start. Um, I think the the, the right one, the, the right bumper next to the live live button. So, um, you have the most game, helping options, leaderboards, achievements, save game, and exit game. Now, in exit game, you can do you can cancel it, exit, and save, or exit without save. And save game means you basically save the game. So, um, also, <coughs> if you want to look at the controls, um, <coughs> um, you, you can look at this, and there's, two, there's, there's three layouts, you can do invert look, self pay, self pat, self cut, self buy, I think that's, and safe sprint. Safe sprint was actually recently added, so I'm just going to start digging this out, so, we want to start with, it's like a little tiny cave house. Now, um, this is this is this is my idea for our first world that I have, our first other world, but I don't have that world anymore. So then now we so you have your house, you have a little cave big enough. If you want to save room, I recommend you putting your crafting stuff in the walls. I'm gonna craft two furnaces. I'm gonna smell things very well furnaces. So another thing is that you wanna go to you wanna go <coughs> so to craft furnaces. One of those structures, and then go down on the crafting table first. <coughs> oh, wait, guys, I'm coughing all up. Okay, so um, now what you want to do is you want I'm going to exit this. Actually, no, you want to be still. You want to still be on the crafting table, and then you want to stay on the structures and go to a door. <coughs> now I'm. Um, Firstly, I recommend you doing one door and a hole because that will save light if you don't have any torches, and it plus it will c prevent mobs from coming in. So like like this, you can see if it's night or day. I recommend this if you don't have like, like anything else. So um, now what you want to do is you. So now what you want to do? How many pieces of wool do we have? Um, not that many. Actually. I need one more. So if you don't have enough materials for your bed, keep going. Go go hunting. Keep swallowing pigs. Basically. And now um oh no she no, no she okay good. So once you have your three pieces of wool, go back to your house. And here you're the house, see? And now what you want to do is you want to go to the crafting table, stay on the structures, go across, and then craft a bed. Now this will allow you to sleep in the night. And um, 
And once again, if you want to save room, we've got chests and stuff. Dig in our area over here, a little bit bigger. <coughs> so it's not too dark. So you can have, um, I'm just going to put a pumpkin here for now. I don't feel like going into my inventory. It's going to stop next time right up. <coughs> now, I just built a cave because it, it won't take too long. So, um, now if you have any, any extra time, you can um, go and start a mine. Now what you want to do is you want to start your mine like this. Now I'm not going to start, start doing it too big, you just want to start it like this. <clears throat> so you can see what the world to I'm like. When I get torches, I'll do that more. So that might be in the next episode, I'm not sure. So now what you want to do, you want to keep killing animals for more food. I mean, you can decorate your house if you want to. Give you that egg. Keep, keep killing stuff so you have enough food. I actually never do this. <coughs> because there's barely any pigs in your spawn. And um, maybe in the next few videos I'm gonna start talking about farming. And the way, I, and the reason why I put that pumpkin over there is so I can recognize my house a little bit better. Okay, so I just wanna keep killing this. Twenty-four. <coughs> oh my God. <coughs> Okay, <clears throat> so now what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to gather some more wood, but I'm going to gather some wood from the villages <clears throat> for more stuff like chests and stuff. Now I'm going to grab all this wood and then I'm going to head back to the shelter and do some extra stuff. I'm going to teach you some extra stuff and then I'm going to teach you some stuff when night comes. Now this might be, um, a, a, I will be uploading two videos today because of the newbie video. And a one well, in, in a regular video, maybe if I have enough time, <coughs> I'll do a regular video and a newbie video a day. But if I don't have enough time, then I don't know. So um, now what you want to do is you want to go to your furnace, take some of the wood, the remaining wood you got, I mean you had from your first tree, and then put that amount of oak wood logs into there. So this will make us charcoal. So if you don't have enough of, so you, if you don't have coal, make some charcoal. Now one piece has formed, I'm just going to use a piece to make um, a, <coughs> a torch quickly. Put it there, 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 there. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this piece of charcoal. I'm actually going to need, I think I might need two for this. So you want to take two charcoal from your other furnace, put it in this furnace, two dozen this furnace, and then put your rod for in there. So I'm just going to eat um, whatever I have in my inventory. So I have some apples on me. That I got from the village. Now you may you may find a village near your spawn. If you are, you're pretty lucky. But I didn't take the diamond because I might. I'm going to say that for the next few episodes. Th that's why this world is offline, by the way. So um, if you if you just want if if you don't have a bed and you want to skip the night so badly, just stay in your little hut. I need. But um, if you want to be mob hunting. Then um follow, follow this. Then um keep watching the video, but you can if you want to. I don't know. Keep watching the video. So now what you're gonna do, if you want to go mob playing, um, we I re I really recommend you killing stuff with at least a stone sword. I, I recommend you killing stuff stuff like I, I recommend you killing every killing mobs with um at least a stone weapon. Endermen, uh, if you find any Endermen, don't kill those. Those are re recommended for um, iron tools. I think you'll die if you have a wooden or stone one. But um, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to keep slaughtering pigs because I feel like it. <coughs> what is wrong with this? Oh, there's a skeleton and a spider. Now, spiders can climb walls, skeletons can shoot. Creepers explode, but they don't explode when they're in water. When they're in water, they'll basically explode, but they won't destroy anything. Some string here. Yeah, I'll take that. So um, now, um, once you've 
gotten tired of killing our mobs, and you decide it's time for me to set my spawn, then do that. What I mean by set your spawn is that um, you can set your spawn by sleeping in your bed. So sleep in your bed, and your spawn will be set where your bed is. If you break your bed, the spawn will be reset to your default spawn. Now your default spawn is where you actually spawned here in the world. You first started the world. Put that in there. Also, um, if you saw me eating while I was in the furnace, it's just a little glitch with the game. No baby. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna craft all this wood into wooden planks. I should have saved a little bit. Then I'm gonna craft um, at least six chests because when you go mining you can get you can you can walk a lot of cobblestone if you know what I mean. So I'm gonna put chests here. I'm gonna break this part up here. I'm gonna break this chest for now because I wanna grab that block right up there. Chest here, so now I can put that chest there so I can open it like this. And you can't actually place chests next to each other, <clears throat> that's kind of weird and um, kind of simple handed at the same time. I don't know why it's just simple handed. So, you want to put your last few chests here, so there's enough room for storage, guys. And, guys, that'll be the end of this video here. And I hope you all enjoyed. I hope all the new people that, that, that came to my channel and the noobs that watched this video. I uh, thank you a lot for watching this video and learning more about Minecraft. There will be more videos coming soon. This is the only the first episode. So guys, stick stick so all noobs stick around guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.